Hey teachers, are you worried about layering your borders? Well, don't worry. I'm gonna take you today through our Border Layering 101 course. But first, let's grab all our supplies. I added our senior year bulletin board paper to the back of our bulletin board. Then, on the metal edge of your board, add Movilis tape and add two of our purple haze borders together. Finish adding it all the way around. Typically, your first layer of borders can be pretty easy. You'll notice here that the metal edge does not make a perfect scallop, so just move up your border to make it perfect and cut off the excess border. The next layer of borders that we're going to use is our Moon Dust Silver Glitter Border. Simply line it up with your Purple Haze Fur Border and make sure that the scallops line up perfectly. Do it on both sides and staple it all the way around your board. With this border, it can be a little tricky to make your scallops perfect, so we're gonna compromise a little bit. Cut off one of the borders, and using an old border, we're gonna draw a scallop with a pencil on your border to make it as perfect as we can. Simply draw a line on your border with your pencil and use a scissors to cut it out. This is the best option, or you can always put a cutout on top of it. Now that we finished our border, our third layer of border is In My Era Friendship Bead Border. With this border, you might need to cut off some of the little cutouts and gold beads to make it fit all the way across. Do this on the top and bottom of your border. Lastly, we're adding our digital printable friendship beads. These are perfect for printing, cutting out, and adding to your border to make a beautiful friendship bead garland. And just like that, you have a beautiful three-layered bulletin board border.